and there is I posted a course schedule if you look at the course information tab on the left side of blackboard you'll see there's a, I think it's called course schedule or course calendar something like that and you'll see when things are due but you'll see some suggestions in terms of um, starting with secondary research meaning in the library on the category and competition etc you can find out about juices uh, then primary research where you do your own surveys with consumers you're going to go to stores and talk to store managers it's hard to do but uh, you're going to take a look at the juice aisle and how, how what's going on there who's prominent who isn't anyway primary research and then you're going to do your SWOT analysis right everybody strengths weaknesses opportunities threats you're going to boil that down to three or four key areas that you'll focus on to accomplish your goal with millennials what do you need to do to be successful with millennials all this needs to be focused on winning millennials not just building the business but winning millennials anyway there's a there's a calendar there um, but I want you to look at that and send me your own calendar no idea generation until you define and understand the problem you do all your research do all your learning you do your SWOT and then you know the problems and then you why in other words why aren't millennials drinking more ocean spray cranberry juice what are they drinking instead what do you have to do to change their minds and get them more interested and that I'm sure is what you'll find out is the, is the issue and the problem and uh, then your ideas need to solve that problem not you know let's uh, you know jump off the George Washington Bridge and cranberry juice parachutes or something you know some wacky idea that has nothing to do with anything right everybody <laughs> uh, secondary and primary research is required and it'll be part of your grade the quality of your research how much you do I want weekly meeting reports I'm going to give you an agenda for that I suggest you take turns writing those um, I have posted a grading rubric which is what I will be looking at and how I will weigh each thing in the grading and take a look at it and um, your team is going to get one grade but then I'm going to ask each of you to rate all the rest of your teammates on one thing which is contribution between one and five five being they made a great contribution if I hear from a couple people on your team and you get a one there's going to be a problem uh, it could really affect your grade so you better kick in here is uh, what should be in your meeting reports that I'm going to get every week and I had better get them it's part of your grade you're going to list attendees you're going to indicate whether they were full-time or part-time in the meeting sometimes people come late and they miss things where and when the meeting was held so if it's a virtual meeting or whatever it is you know give me the time and tell me on what platform you had the meeting you're going to list key areas of discussion one two three four what was agreed we all agreed we do this we all agreed we would put this off we all agreed that we will focus on that whatever it is and then every meeting should have next steps so you move things ahead your team leader is going to help divide up uh, assignments and uh, everybody's going to kick in and the report needs to have who is responsible for doing what by when I want it sent to me I want it sent to all the members of the team and typically whoever writes it asks for feedback or corrections and if you don't get them then that is the Bible in terms of what's happening with the team and how do you start your next team meeting you pull up the meeting report from the last team meeting you go over it and then you look at the progress on the next steps and go from there so tell them what you told them tell them tell them what you're gonna tell them sorry everybody it's 547 in the morning now tell them what you're gonna tell them tell them tell them what you told them and now this is my tell them what you told them and that is we talked about offers we talked about uh, LTV and CRM I introduced your ocean spray case study and some next steps and um, 
Now, by the way, you're going to be getting feedback on your company presentations out of all this discussion and everything from that. And I gave you that assignment for a couple of reasons. One, I wanted your teams to start right off the bat getting together on something you could do quickly so you could, it would help form your team. And two, I wanted you to get practice doing a presentation and then getting some feedback so that your final presentation will build on whatever you learned from the first presentation in terms of how to give a presentation so I can actually see you improve in your presenting and how you organize it and how you give it, okay? Um, now, uh, also please, for the next class, October 3rd, read Chapter 24. Um, and the next team, I forget which one has already done it, I think. I know team one has done it. I think team two has done it. So I think it's team three, but I'm getting a little fuzzy on this, but you guys should know this. Whatever the next team is in the rotation needs to find a direct ad in the media, at a medium, medium it appeared in and submit it in the, um, in that assignment section on the first content page. And then all teams will be doing Tabasco and discussing it. So we're going to have that to do before the next class, too. So it's busy, busy, busy time. And that's the end of the class. And now um, you're at the end of level two and need to move up to level three. But to do that, there's a puzzle to solve. As with the last one, each of you will get your own copy of the puzzle. And um, But I want you, please, to work on it as a team and solve it, and you need exact answers. I think this one is a crossword puzzle. Um, and you got them right, and you got the clue to open level three. And at the top of level three, you'll see another clue to the overall riddle. What event was heard round the world? Over and out. See you in level three.